Okay, hi guys! Welcome back to my corner. So today we are going to be snacking. We have our Munch Pack box. It came this month and I don't really order this every month but whenever it's time for me and my daughter to bond, uh, I try to order it for her so her and I can do this video together. Let's go ahead and taste test this box. already munch pack is basically snacks from around the world we have the mini munch pack which gets you five types of snacks from around the world you can also get the original one and the family pack so the mini one is i think around 13 or 14 dollars i'll put the price right here um, but the mini one is just right for us. It gives us a chance to try all of these snacks from around the world without having too much leftovers. So, in case you're wondering, this is my special guest, Trinity, my daughter. I see something kind of like a dupe here, like we've tried this before. Which one do you want to try first? This one. Okay, this one is the Haribo, Haribo Rainbow Twist. Okay, so it looks like this. It looks good, but it looks hard. I'm not big on candy snacks. Haribo is from Germany. Mmm. Okay. I think they're like gummies. They're very fruity <laughs> and hard to chew. It looks like a hard rock. <laughs> I mean, my gums hurt trying to chew on this, trying to bite on it. She put the snack back. No good? No. On a scale of 1 to 10, what's the score? I'm number 1. A little. 1. It's a little I agree. Like... This is a 1. No good. No. Okay, and then I put another one in. Oh, why do I do this to myself? <laughs> Next one is from Bazooka. Bazooka. Mm -hmm. Juicy Drop Blast. This is from the United States of America. Okay, so this is from the US of A, guys. Perfect mix of sweet and sour delicious fruit, flavored chews with a fun sour twist. I'm scared. I'm not big on sour snacks. Oh, look at this. They're individually packaged. So that's nice. What do you have, the green? Yeah, I'll go to the green. Let's try it. Oh dear. Mmm. Mmm. It's another like fruit chew. It's not bad. If you've had high chews before, that's what they pretty much taste like. There's a hint of sourness, but it's not overpowering, so I don't mind it. I can't stand like candy that's sour, but I love sour food like sour mango, like the one that's not ripe. Mm. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. Scale of one to ten. Maybe a ten. Maybe a ten. Yeah, I would say an eight for me. I like it. I don't mind it. It's so squishy like Play-Doh. Oh yeah, it is like Play-Doh. It's squishy like Play-Doh. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is something we can eat. It's very portable. You can bring it anywhere. It's individually packaged. Very good. Okay, next one. Let's do this one. Pizza Pretz. All right. Yeah, with cheese? I'm going to insert a video clip, but I think we've tried this before. Right, which one do you want to do next? We're doing the pretzel. So I think we've tried this on our last Munch Pack unboxing. This is from Thailand. Yeah, it's from Thailand because I remember it had a little bit of spice to it. It's a pretzel bite full of pizza flavor. I love this easy open tab they have in the back. So I just like lift it up. And here it is. Mm. It tastes like cheese pizza. It does taste like cheese pizza. Pepperoni. It, pepperoni. It has all the flavors of pizza. I mean, they got it right. 
has a little spice to it. Where's our water? We've done three snacks. We've got two more. Let's do this. Which one do you want to do next? The chips. Okay. Ooh, okay. This is kettle cooked buffalo wing chips. I like buffalo wings. Okay, let's see. This is from... Huh? This is from the United States again. That's no fun. I want to get something else. I mean, I'm glad to get something from the United States, but I want to try something outside of here. Some food that I can't have and that it's out of my reach. Comment down below if you've tried this type of chips or kettle chips before. I've never tried it, so at least it's something new to me, but I'm just kind of bummed that it's also, again, from the United States. Why do we have to have two? Right? I, I want to try something else. Because this is snacks from around the world. It's your good old standard potato chips. <laughs> oh, it's spicy. It's spicy. It really hits you. Not my favorite. I think it needs a little bit of saltiness. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it does taste like buffalo wings. I gotta give them that. But I don't like it in chips. Mm. Last one. This is the Ulker Coconut. Not coconut, it's coconut. Coconut wafers. <laughs> I like wafers. And it looks like this has chocolate in them. And this is from Turkey. All right, crispy wafers filled with smooth hazelnut cream covered in milk chocolate. It looks like this, in case you guys are wondering. It looks like Oreos. Uh-huh. Or brownies. Yep. Ooh. Mmm. Mmm, crunchy. It tastes like chocolate and brownies mm -hmm. love that you can taste the nuts so you can actually bite into it really good i like this one the hazelnut comes through tastes like nutella kit kat kit kat what's your favorite oh okay so she was already holding this actually this is the juicy drop blast from the united states this is her favorite and my favorite, I love chocolate. What can I say? This one um, from Turkey. Chocolate wafers. Love this. Love the taste. I'm going to finish this off. This is not edible. This is another one that is not my favorite. I wouldn't eat it. This one's about to go down. <laughs> Oh, the pizza pretzel is not bad. It's one of my faves too. It would come in third out of all the snacks. So actually it would come in second for me because I love savory snacks. So that is it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, like, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'm so glad I got to do this with my daughter again. I miss having her in my videos. Um, comment down below what else we could do together here on my video. What would you guys like us to do together? Because I think that would be really fun. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Right. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the no notification bell. And with that said, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And I'll definitely see you back in my corner soon. Bye!